Hello everyone, welcome back. So in this video, we are going to understand a very important question of uh, today contest problem, right? So this problem is based on uh, string manipulations, right? And so let's understand here, right? So welcome back to the channel. And in this video, we are going to solve this problem, right? So what we have given, we have given a statement that you are given a string S that consists of English letter in the lower case and we have a special character like this right means you are given a string s that contains lower case uh, letters and some special characters like uh, star has and percentage right so uh, the rules we also saying that uh, star removes the last character from the result and has uh, duplicates the current result and it appends its right and uh, percentage or you can see mode reverses the uh, result string right so we have to use these uh, characters right and we have to build the final string by uh, processing from left to right right we'll start from here and we'll keep processing like this okay so if you observe this let's suppose for this example so what we have given we have a index 0 we have a right so what we need to do we have to up append the operation a right and so we'll get what a a now we are getting what has we are getting means we have to duplicate the result so we will duplicate this result right then we are getting what b means we have to append it let's append it right so it will come like this right now we are getting uh, this percentage right so we have to re reverse the result so we will re reverse this result into this one right so b will come first then a a okay then star means remove the last character what is the last character a right here so we'll remove this from here and this will become your final result i hope you understand right so now understand the code how to implement it right so very first to append multiple times right we'll use the string right a string as a string builder because a string builder uh, will not create multiple times uh, multiple times the uh, memory in the java right so a string builder uh like a string if you write the string that what will happen it will create the uh you can say string constant pool and it, it will waste the memory right so we'll use result here and uh, as a string builder and then we'll go for all the characters so if you want to convert all the characters from here right give me one second i'll teach you so let's suppose uh we have this result right let's suppose we have given a string is a star and has something we have has and then we have given let's suppose b we have given something like that we have given okay so this is in the string can we say that this is in the string so index 0 1 2 3 like this we have given but we have to get one by one character so what we need to do we have to convert this into uh, a, a like a array character array so character array will represent like this 0 1 2 3 so at a time one character we can get from here right so we'll say the first character is a then we have a star then we have has like this we have to consider here okay and so that we can get one by one character at here if we'll make the loop right so this is just a for loop right and you can make a for loop from a simple loop you can also start from i equal to zero and you can go from here okay and you can get a character care and you can make the same condition that we have written here right this is the requirement that we have to do okay let's understand what the requirement is based. very first what we are saying if character is greater than or equal to a and character is less than or equal to z means lower english letter a to z if the character is between these boundaries right means itself it is inclusive right means from a and z including a and z if the character is coming in the given uh, array that we have created right from there if we'll taking one character and if it is in this range then what we will do we'll append in the result so let's suppose very first we have a so we'll say append into the re uh, result and this is your result okay then we'll check if else in else condition if it is star then what we need to do we'll check if result is greater than zero means there is there will be some element will be there right before let's suppose if initially in the starting position we are getting the star here right at this position this is not a it means initially what we have we have a uh, blank uh, result right there is no string is there then we don't need to delete it right because it is already uh, empty right 
So before that, we'll make a condition and we'll check length should be greater than zero. If any length is there, means the SB that is a result we have. So this result should have some data like this, not like this. If not like this, then we will not delete here. We'll just discard. It. We'll continue the further uh, conditions. Okay. We'll come here and here. I hope you understand. Then we'll check if in the else condition we'll check another else will make if it is not star and not it is between the character lowercase it may be has if it is has then we'll check what we will append into the result we'll append it result dot append result dot to a string whatever the result we have we will append two times that is called we'll get the result right this is original string that we have a if we are getting star let's suppose this was uh, this was star right so we will delete it let's suppose this was not star this is b so it will become a b again but if it is coming here what has let's suppose it means what we need to do we have to double it so this is we have here a b we will do double so this is when we do uh, result dot uh, to a string we will assign let's suppose we'll uh, say result dot to, to a string this part we'll say this is this part and now we are adding on the result so this is the original result and this is a b b a b is the to a string so we'll both we will append it so it will become a b a b two times it will become okay here now else condition will check if else condition it is uh, percentage let's suppose we'll reverse it whatever we will have let's say b a b a baba okay and then we'll return a result finally so this type uh, this uh, this is the way we will uh, write the code and we'll implement it that uh, the time complexity will take o of n and a space will become o of n also both will become o of n only the in the worst case what will happen let's suppose the size uh, we have uh, for the result let's suppose we are reversing here right we are re reversing the size so what will happen if m is the size of the let's suppose is the uh, result right so we are in the worst case what we are doing we are doubling it let's suppose then, then what will become let's suppose this is the original size and this is the result size so this may increase in the worst case right but there can be another worst case let's suppose we are having many has we have here right because it is duplicating as you can see right so there will be a chance it will become 2 of o, uh, o to the power uh, o uh, sorry o 2 to the power n right because there can be multiple times we are duplicating it okay so you have to consider you you have to uh, better you pause this video and go through understand what the complexity is there right so you will not have the uh, uh, difficulty to find the uh, duplicacy and uh, the exact time uh, time uh, complexity okay so for now just think that this is the time complexity in the worst cases these are the possibilities that we can find okay this is the final m is the final uh, we can say length of the result and n is the original one so there can be possibility that in the worst case this will happen in the very worst case it will become like this because there can be many as uh, we possibility where we will duplicating multiple times okay anyways i'll see you in the next one